Now, I owe Dan Mullen an apology. Um, you know, I've been, Have you given him an apology? Yet? I'm going to do it right now. Boom, let's do it. Yeah, All right, go I, for I it. Here's your camera right I owe, here. I owe Dan an apology. I have a tremendous amount of respect for Dan Mullen. And, you know, I should never have said that in a, in a way that would have got reference back to him. Okay, uh, Dan is not a jackass. Although he did come out as Darth Vader after a game. <laughs> and I came back with the response. In no way did I think that was going to have anything to do with him getting let go. And I, I sure hope it didn't. And then the comments after that. Uh, you know, I was doing an interview on a, on a Monday morning after the game yeah. and really didn't, you know, when you, when you're like me and you kind of talk, you don't wait, don't always wait your words as, as well as you should have. And, uh, you know, if I had it to do over again, I wouldn't have done that because I have a lot of respect for Dan Mullen. Yeah. Same. Coach Dan, there you go.